Good afternoon ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to Heavy Repping. My name is John Tron Davidson and I'm here once again in our best mega 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 super 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 secret test location in the southwest of England. One of the companies with which Heavy Repping has a relatively uh, involved history is Iron Age. Uh, Iron Age are based out of Texas. They're all made by a gentleman by the name of Alexis Rodeo who you can read an interview with at heavyrepping.com and Alex has made some incredible stuff like the Helios uh, and the Parthenon XL but today I'm going to be talking to you about this. That's right, today I'm finally talking about the Megalith Ultra. Uh, now this one is uh, a big lad, it is around 9mm, my personal example is about 87 but uh, it's made from a material called UHMWPE, which is Ultra High Molecular Weight Polyethylene. Now unfortunately it doesn't have a snappier title than that, but the material is incredibly tough. Uh, it's very, very fast through the strings and it doesn't really weigh anything. So I've got picks that are slimmer, uh, but weigh more. Uh, than this one does and it is made in a slightly different way from all other uh, UHMWPE picks that I've come across in the sense that it is finished in wax. Uh, now what that means is that it gives you a little bit more grip on the pick. Now one of the characteristics of UHMWPE is that it, it can be a little bit on the slick side, however uh, a little bit of important information from you, a public service announcement if you like from Heavy Repping is that if your hands get uh, damp in any way, particularly if you're playing live and your hands get a little bit sweaty, uh, it will become almost instantaneously adhesive. And uh, I found that to be um, very much true in a live setting. So what I'm gonna do today is fire it through the stick, the board and the WEM uh, into my Zoom Q2N as ever and let you hear exactly how it behaves. So without further ado, let's do the business. So let's talk a little bit about this beefy old thing. When I got started in picks, it was everything was kind of round about the sort of two to four mil mark, and they've just kind of got exponentially larger. Um, if you have seen my giant picks video, which you can see down in the description, um, you'll know that I'm no stranger to large plectrums, but this one particularly has been an awful lot of fun to play with. I have to say that I do appreciate the fact that Alexis has put wax on the outside, UHMWPE, as I said, is not the grippiest material initially and having that little bit extra really does make a massive difference. I would also like to say that it's quite an education in terms of grip because I, having grown up holding quite thin plectrums, I grip my picks far too tightly and using a pick that's thicker does mean that I don't have to hold it as hard. Now, that might not sound like much of a thing, but when you are playing especially quickly, uh, not having to grip vice like as well means that you're not going to damage your wrists and tendons quite as much. I've just written an article about this at the website about preserving your wrists, which you can go and read. But the important thing is, is that if you are somebody who has reduced grip strength, uh, or you have um, difficulty holding on to thinner plectrums, then a pick like this is absolutely ideal and it will last for all time, pretty much. Uh, 
I have to say, of all the picks of this nature that I've used, this is definitely, categorically, one of my favourites. And uh, it's got a real purposeful quality to it, as does most of the stuff from Iron Age. So I would encourage you to go and check it out. Follow uh, Iron underscore Age underscore Guitar at Instagram. And uh, at Instagram? On Instagram and you'll be able to find out all about his crazy range. He does a whole bunch of acrylics and ivory substitutes and all that. So go and check it out. Uh, you get a th firm thumbs up and recommendation from me here at Heavy Repping. So I hope you've enjoyed this week's video. Next week I'll be back with more Plictrology uh, in our super mega mega bunker bunker best 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 place. In the meantime, my name is John Tron Davidson. This is Heavy Repping. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe and go to the website, follow us on Instagram at Heavy Repping and you'll be able to catch up on all of the stuff that uh, I'm doing with all sorts of different companies from all over the world doing all sorts of things. Just remember, if you're not sure what to do in life, rep hard, rep heavy. <laughs>